What is going on, guys and gals, and whatever the other stuff is? Welcome back to the channel. Today, folks, we're gonna run down another meal plan. That's right, I'm giving this one to you for free. And that's how y'all should know I'm a good person. The only thing you get for free nowadays is sexually transmitted diseases. Trust me, fellas, it's all fun and games until you come home with an itch you just can't seem to scratch. All right, enough jibber jabbering. Meal plan time. If you're trying to lose weight, you're trying to build muscle, eat good food, all of that, you came to the right place. If you were clueless before, you won't be after this video. We're gonna make this quick, easy, efficient, and dare I say, a little sexy. If all that sounds good to you, particularly the last one. Then let's get this show started with meal one. Come on. All right, we're gonna lay some ground rules. Every meal today is gonna contain protein. Protein's essential. It's as important as the air you breathe, the soil from which we plant the seeds, the easy money to be had from an OnlyFans. It's as important, if not more important, than all those combined. The more protein we consume, the more likely the body is to burn fat instead of muscle while we're doing a diet. The more muscle you have on your body, the more calories you burn just existing. It's a win, win, win. So we need that protein, baby. This is my preferred brand of choice. Optimum gold, baby. Look how big that tub is. You might have to start with a two pounder and after you put about a year or two in, they'll let you carry one of these around. So for meal one, we're gonna get in that protein and make it delicious. We're gonna make an easy shredding smoothie. Drank the crap out of this thing when I was coming up. And keep in mind, any recipe I show you guys today, you can always find in my cookbook, which you can check out in the link in the description box or elsewhere on my channel in a video, but I will be putting ingredients up on the screen for you. This is quick and easy. We start with our almond milk, then a scoop of our whey. We toss in our frozen strawberries and our frozen blueberries, our peanut powder, and then finally our zero calorie sweetener. Now we just give a quick blend. Woo! And boom, baby. Meal one, shredding smoothie, 253 calorie, five grams of fat, 30 grams of protein, 22 grams of carbs, five grams of fiber. Easy money, baby. Ooh, that's good. Cool part where this is, you can make a bunch of them in advance, toss them in the fridge. Or you can make it, take it with you, put some ice in it, drink it at your earliest convenience. We're getting protein, micronutrients, fiber. Can't beat the shredding smoothie, baby. You just can't beat it. So let's say you drink this, right? And you go to the gym right after. And then after the gym, you gotta eat again. Well, you're in luck, because I got that covered. Come on. All right, guys, I'm gonna give you a little trivia fact. The recipe we're about to make, I've eaten more than any other recipe I've ever created. I'll give you a second to guess. Time's up. We're making chocolate chip waffles, one of my favorites. Start with our vanilla green yogurt, then the egg beaters or egg whites, whichever one you want to use, but then we just toss in the instant pancake waffle mix, then we're going back to the way, we're going to need a scoop of this. This is going to be about the time where you wish you had a five pounder, but you have not earned it yet. Then we just got our sugar free chocolate chips, and then finally, a little dash of some baking powder. Now we just go in, stir it up till we got a batter. Oh baby, that's how she should look, bud. Dripping. And at this point, you are going to need an appliance. You're going to need a waffle maker. Here's the one I got. This is an oster I picked up on Amazon for like 20 bucks. Now that was a few years ago due to inflation, they could be a thousand dollars. Pray to the Lord Almighty, if the wafflers get that high, we're doomed. You can tell how much I use it because of how dirty it is. You know, I could clean it, but I feel like that's a badge of honor. You don't want to end up like that guy with the Jeep that he puts tens of thousands of dollars into that is the most crazy off-road machine in the world, but there ain't a scratch on it. All that for what? You know what I mean? He ain't using that thing. Now this bad boy is gonna yield two massive Belgian waffles. We're just gonna spoon this batter in here. I'm gonna get her spread out. I'm gonna close this lid. It'll be about two to three minutes of waff. And then we'll be in business, boys and girls and the other stuff. And boom, chocolate chip waffles, baby. We got them doused in a little bit of that Miss Butter's work. I told y'all we'd be getting a little sexy. We also got some fat-free whipped cream. And these chocolate chip waffles, we're getting 482 calories, 10 grams of fat, 54 grams of protein, 44 grams of carbs, 10 grams of fiber. All right, let's get in here and get a bite. Don't mind if I do. Ooh, now let's get you guys some better lighting. Look at that, baby. Mm, mm, mm. Telling y'all, don't sleep on these, but do as you lose. Mm, mm, mm. Now I don't care what anybody says, that's the best protein waffle recipe on the internet. I'd bet my life on it. Not only is this easy, it's gonna fill you up, give you a ton of protein, not even feel like you're dieting. Easy to whip up too, especially when we got the RJF cookbook. Check it out, we got all the ingredients, all the exact macros. This thing is loaded down with recipes, baby. Look at that. Ooh, who's that handsome devil? Literally, jam-packed over 350 pages. And every time I drop a new recipe, it gets added to the book for free. You get it once. You get all those recipes, baby. You can have this thing in your phone, on your computer, on any device you own that way. When you're trying to lose weight and you go food at the same time, you literally have the ultimate guide in your pocket. I'm telling y'all, you follow us in this book, you really do. You'll see results no matter what. You just gotta get in the kitchen and do it. If you can do that, you can have whatever you want, baby. Hit that link down below. I know if you do, you will not regret it. All right, folks, I'm gonna go ahead and finish this. Ooh, get a little bit of this good stuff. Ooh, and I'll see you guys at the next meal. Mm. All right, ladies and gentlemen, meal number three. This is gonna be a little snack. We don't gotta cook nothing, we don't gotta prep nothing, but we do wanna get in a little protein and satisfying cravings we're having. So check it out. You guys already know I love snacks. 
snacks like this right here. These Quest chips are up there, bud. These are basically like Doritos, except way better for you. They still make your fingers cheesy. They didn't solve that problem. In this bag, 150 cal, six fat, five carb, 18 protein. And these things legitimately look just like Doritos. These things have never steered me wrong. Oh yeah. Yep. Having stuff like this around is great in a pinch when you get a little hungry. You can always use beef jerky, protein bars, pork rinds, lots of snacks. Just keep them around these calories, that 150, and you'll be good to go to use it on this meal plan. Anyways, guys, that's meal three. Once you guys see meal four, ooh, might make your head spin. Come on. All right, folks. For meal four, we're gonna have ourselves a crunch wrap, just like Taco Bell, minus the diarrhea. First, we'll get our beef ready, a little nonstick. 112 grams, 96% lean beef. We're gonna go ahead and chop this up and get it brown. And once it's browned, a little low sodium taco seasoning, then a little bit of water and now we're just making taco meat. All right, now we need a burrito tortilla. We're gonna place her. We're gonna go ahead and place our meat right in the middle. Then our fat-free cheese, a little bit of pico. Then we'll just take a baked tostada and some refried beans. We'll spread these on here and butter it like a piece of bread. Butter that bread, boy. Then we'll just place the tostada bean side down. Create a nice little shield, press it a little bit. Now we're gonna fold it. What we're gonna do is how this is gonna go down. We're gonna create a little fold here, right? Boom, and take this, boom. Keep that locked in. You're gonna grab this one, fold it up over, boom. Watch this, pinch that, fold, boom. Not so hard, huh? Boom. Fold that one, boom, boom, and bingo. Double check, make sure they're all tight, just like that. And all we're gonna do, being very careful, is flip this over, slowly but surely. We'll make sure your folds don't come undone. Boom, boom, boom. All right, now we're gonna let this sit here for a few minutes. Let the underside get toasty. Once that's locked into place, we'll flip it. Let the top get toasted, and then we're officially gonna be in business. More specifically, the fast food business. See y'all in a sec. And boom, meal four is ready to go. Obviously we got the crunch wrap. I did add a little bit of queso cheese. It's surprisingly low in calories. So if you use it sparingly, you'll be all right. Now in this meal, we're getting 525 calories with nine grams of fat, 52 grams of protein, 59 grams of carbs with four grams of fiber. Do a little dip and a dab. Ooh, cheers folks. Mm, mm, mm. Just take a look at that. Tell me that doesn't look perfect. Like I said, it's Taco Bell minus the, I don't even need to say it at this point, you get it. Mm -hmm. It's hard to complain about your diet when you're eating food like this. That's the whole point of the anabolic diet, the recipes, the cookbook, and all that. If it doesn't feel like a diet, it becomes a lifestyle. When it becomes a lifestyle, living lean, barely gotta try, baby. Mm. I'm gonna go ahead and scarf this down. I'll see y'all shortly. You already know what time it is. Come on. Hey, boy, is it snack time, boy? Oh, I think it's snack time for that. What is up, what is up, boy? Oh, I wanna give you a kiss. Big wet kiss. Just kidding, guys, I don't kiss my dog. I don't kiss my dog. All right, it's time for a meal. We don't need a full-fledged meal yet, but we need another snack. And this is where protein bars come into play. Now, we could have one of these RX bars, but to be honest, I don't feel like throwing up. I know I'm biased, I'm not even kidding. These are terrible. I got this box for free and it's still completely full. Often imitated, never duplicated. They try though. Yeah, I don't recommend those. Then, I don't know if you've ever had one of these, but you know what, I better not say anything. He's always watching. And a bar. Actually, these are the old ones. Heard the new ones are better, so I can't really speak to them, but me and Greg are cool now, so have yourselves a calories in, calories out bar if you want. Boy, that's a mouthful. So we're gonna go ahead and just go with the world's best tasting protein bar, the Anna bar. I'm gonna do it in this strawberry flavor, baby. Boom! Obviously, I've had romantic relationships with all these bars, so every time a new one comes out, I'm pretty hooked. Oh my gosh. It's the strawberry white chocolate for me, though. Ooh, and if you look close in there, you can see a leprechaun. Cheers, folks. Mmm, 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 mmm. That's how you make a protein bar that doesn't suck. Very carefully. Meal five, 270 calories, nine grams of fat, 20 grams of protein, 29 grams of carbs. Easy peasy. Once again, eating that protein in every single meal. And I know if you go Anabar, you won't be disappointed. In honor of Anabar, it is giveaway time, baby. I give away a box of the world's best tasting protein bar in every video. You just gotta like the video, be subscribed, leave a comment. I choose a winner. Winner from the last video is Mr. Sharp Games with a comment. James, you're great, bro. Keep up the great work. Thank you. You're impacting lives more than you know. I'm down 30 pounds. Not to mention, I'm trying my second flavor of Anabar. Ooh. This man knows the way to my heart. Congrats on the 30 pounds, man. Glad uh, I could be of help. I always do say this, though. As much as you can lead a horse to water, you can't force it to drink. At the end of the day, you had to put the work in, and 30 pounds is proof that you did. So appreciate you Email me at the email in my description box. You get one of these lovely boxes at you ASAP. Everybody else. We're in a ton of retailers. GNC, Hy-Vee, H-E-B, Come and Go, Hy-Vee, 24 Hour Fitness, and we're growing all the time. I got a store locator on the site. You can always hit up those places to check it out, or you can visit theanabar.com. My code RGF10 will save you money, and I'm telling you, unlike some of the metal bars, this one ain't gonna kiss and tell. All right, folks, we got one more meal on this program, man. Let me eat this. We'll get to that. You already know the deal.
All right, folks, meal six, we're gonna be making a steak and shake fresco mount. Y'all ever had steak and shake? I have, but the memory of it's a blur. They should probably call it steak and lake, because every time I was in there, it was past midnight and I was blasted. But that's a story for another time. We need two pieces of sourdough bread, and we're gonna go ahead and hit a side of it with some zero calorie butter spread. We're gonna do that to both pieces. Now we'll just toss these butter side down on a skillet for a few minutes, let them get nice and toasty. And while that bread's toasting, we'll get our fresco sauce ready. In a bowl, we start with 16 grams sugar-free ketchup. We need 17 grams fat-free Catalina, 19 grams fat-free Thousand Islands, and then all we do now is mix this up with a spoon. Ooh, mama. And easy peasy we got. 224 grams, 96% lean ground beef. We just need about 15 grams of Worcestershire sauce. Then we'll hit it with a little bit of salt and pepper. Boom, now we mix. All right, once it's mixed, we're gonna separate this into two balls, as even as possible. Then we'll just form them by hand. Boom, boom, boom. Then we'll go ahead and give these a quick fry. Boom, boom. It's burger time. All right, it's building time. Take one of our pieces of toasted sourdough, lay it down. Then she needs about half of our sauce. Follow it up by a piece of white American cheese. Then a patty, then fat-free American. The other patty. Finally, our final piece of bread with the sauce. Bingo. And there she is, folks. Not gonna lie, the sourdough bread's a little bigger than what I normally get. But I think we're gonna be just fine. In meal six, we're getting 612 calories, 16 grams of fat, 60 grams of protein, 57 grams of carbs, baby. Boom, Harukin. The best part about this fresco melt is I'm not blasted. Here we go. Mm. Mm -mm. Boy, boy, boy. That's what I call a sandwich. Mm. That's how it's done, folks. Now, if you made it to the end of the program, what you got if you ate every single meal on this bad boy is 2,295 calories, 55 grams of fat, 234 grams of protein, 216 grams of carbs, 22 grams of fiber. And right there is exactly what you need if you're trying to be lean, build muscle, and have one of them Roman statue physiques. This is exactly how I eat. You saw the numbers. You saw the foods. This is exactly what I do. I eat this almost every single day. I might have a little cheat meal on a weekend or something, but this is basically what I do. Now, this line is terrible, but it is super easy for me to maintain this right here. This really didn't take much effort at all. Literally. I stay nice and lean, got the muscles popping. Ooh. Core's pretty tight. And if I ever wanted to get like super shredded, all I'd have to do is drop my calories a little bit. It's really that easy. Calories in, calories out, eat enough protein, a lot of thermodynamics, I'll never lie to you. And it's not just these meals I eat, it's a ton of other ones. I literally just pick foods out of the good old cookbook, make whatever I want, make sure it fits my calorie goals for the day, and I'm straight. Get a ton of protein, eat good food. It is that easy, folks. If you got this bad boy, make sure you're grabbing your updated copies. Every time I drop new recipes, they get put in here. If you don't have it, then you can always check out the link in my description box. I know. If you follow this and no diets have worked for you, this could be the one that finally changes everything. You just gotta do it, baby. Every action creates an equal and opposite reaction. Pick the right actions, you get the right reactions. Link down below. Ooh, one heck of a video, guys. Hopefully you enjoyed it. Thanks as always for stopping by. I appreciate each and every one of you. Couldn't do what I do without y'all. If you ever like the clothes I'm wearing, like the tank or the shorts with a wallet pocket. 99.9% .9 of the time I'm rocking young LA. You can always check their stuff out. Younglay.com. My code RJ will save you money. They got stuff for men and women. And finally, my personal trainer. I can make you a meal plan built with foods just like woof. Terrible lighting. Hold on. Boom. That guy right there where you fill out a questionnaire and I build it based on your stats and all that. That sounds good. Go to my website, RemsJamesFitness.com. Woo. That is the heaviest camera on the planet. Until next time, folks, I will see each and every one of you at the next video. See you guys. Boom, 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 boom. We gone.